How, how many people in the world love football? Yeah, yeah. and he would have it as a hat. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, I'm Lloyd Griffith and this is Super Field Scenarios, a Southampton themed version of the classic conversational game, Would You Rather? The only rule of the game is that players have to give an answer and their reason for the answer. That is it. Today, I'll be probing Saints teammate Alex McCarthy, Carl Walker Peters, and Jan Bednarek. Can you guys just wave? Is that all right? Just, just wait. There you go. Okay, gents, let's get on with the game. Kyle, would you rather have a football for a head or linesman's flags for arms? I have, if I have a football for a head, do I still have eyes, nose, and a mouth? Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. But you've also got to pump your own head up every two to three days. <laughs> you've got to carry around a pump with you the whole time. Yeah, I'd rather have a football as a head. I don't want look... flags as hands. That's ridiculous. It's more natural. Football, so having a football as a head football is more natural than having flags as arms. Yeah, definitely. You'll get people coming up to and kicking his head in that. Exactly. <laughs> but imagine football how people, how, how many people in the world love football. Yeah. yeah. And he would have it as a head. <laughs> 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 that is so philosophical, and I love it. Um, Alex, what are you going for? Um, flags his arms. You're going flags his arms? <laughs> yeah. You know how skinny your arms would be? And short. Get thick poles. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't right. want to be walking around with a football head. And yeah, you're the only person in the world with a football head as well. You can never use a phone again. Yeah, you could use Siri. <laughs> <laughs> just use, you just have a Siri enabled the whole time. Alex, would you rather, and I think I know the answer to this already, would you rather go on a European tour with the lads or on a lovely holiday with your partner? <laughs> <laughs> if you asked me this a couple of years ago, it would have been a European holiday with the lads, but now I've got kids, I'm a bit more mellowed. I'd go with the family. Kyle? A European holiday with the boys. Oh, Sorry. okay, okay. <laughs> yeah. One Tiebreaker, Jan, what are you doing? Yeah, I go with Kyle. Trip with the lads, yeah. You have to find the balance, you know? Yeah. Whilst Alex is going for a lovely little pottery tour around Kavos. Kyle, would you rather win the Ballon d'Or or win the Premier League? <laughs> Are you going selfish here? Uh, you uh, take him off the team. Easy, Kyle. I mean, yeah, win the Premier League. <laughs> <laughs> he had to think about that. You, li you liar. Who wouldn't want to be the best, like, recognises the best player in the world? I gave the right answer. <laughs> After about 13 minutes, you gave yeah. the right answer. Alex, what are you going for? Premier League. Yeah, you've got to go Premier League. <laughs> yeah, he's watching. The gaffer's going to watch <laughs> yeah. it. Going, All right, OK. Um, Jan, would you rather play the whole of next season with a mullet or a top knot? <laughs> Mullet, I will go, go for the first option, yeah. I think you would look very good in a mullet, and even, not ironically. I might try it. Might do it this weekend. <laughs> a little number two, just down the side. A little bit of business around the back. Absolutely lovely. Um, Alex, what are you going for? Top knot or mullet? Yeah, I think I'd go top knot rather than a mullet. That's a bit old school, isn't it? Kyle, what are you going for? Top knot. You going top knot? Yeah. Why wouldn't you go for the mullet? I just don't think it would look good with my afro hair. <laughs> Look, you could be the first to try it. You see Carl Walker Peters? He's got a mullet. Alex, would you rather travel back in time and watch a classic match from the past or travel forward in time and see what football is like in the future? Travel forward in time. Oh, really? Yeah. What do you think it will be like? Um, Kyle there with a the football for a head. Yeah, that. People running around with flags <laughs> his arms. <laughs> So you wouldn't want to go back and see, like, England win the World Cup in the 60s? Yeah, but yeah. I'd just rather go forward. Again, that's very philosophical. I love that as well. Kyle, what are you doing? <laughs> forward or back? You're going forward? Yeah. Jan, what are you doing? I would be ready for the future. Like, robo-football. 11 robots <laughs> against 11 humans. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> I'd say, well, like, a game maybe, like, on the moon. Um, although, ultimately, there would be no atmosphere. Yeah, okay, let's move on to the next question, <laughs> if that's all right. Uh, uh, Kyle, would you rather get out of a high-intensity training session or get out of a post-match interview? What would you rather do? Be blowing mm. or talking hot air? I'd rather be blowing, uh, to be honest. Really? No, you don't like to be blowing. Uh, you don't <laughs> like it. <laughs> well, you'd rather miss the high-intensity session? No, I'd rather do the high-intensity session. Oh, really? Why? Yeah. Do you just love fitness? I mean, as long as I've got a ball at my feet, I mean, I'm happy. He's one of them guys that don't need to run and he can just run all day. Yeah. I'm, yeah, same. I'm, I'm one of the lucky ones. 
Yeah. <laughs> yeah, same here, Carl. I guess we've got quite similar. Right? Um, Jan, post-match interview or high-intensity training? No, high-intensity training, yeah. Really? All day long. So, yeah. Um, Alex? I'd rather do high-intensity training. Really? Yeah. I find that quite insulting to what we're doing now, but fair enough. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> <That's funny. better. laughs> Unbelievable. Well, that's it. A big thanks to Alex, Carl and Jan for playing, and thank you all for joining us. Please don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.